Welcome back. I made some changes. So this is what I want it to look like, um, you know, permanently. So I just built around, built up a little bit, moved some stuff around. Uh, I put these these walls here in the middle just to create more more space, like shelving space and stuff. But this, this is the way it's going to go. It's going to be a small place and pretty simple. I did add a downstairs just because there are things that we don't really need to access all the time, but they still take space. I made a little bedroom here. That's going to be a window. This is going to be the whatever room, you know, for barrels fermenting or leather making. The little fire pit room, and this will probably be my uh, my new cellar. I'm probably going to make another change, though. This isn't permanent. I'm thinking about making like because I, I don't like the ladder like the hole in your house with the ladder unless it's like going up into an attic or something or a basement but this is not really a basement i might just make this like a walk down here a little curve around and then just move my bedroom somewhere else but anyway that's all uh that's all future stuff today we're gonna get a little bit of see if we could get this pulverizer working and I want to get some crops going because we uh, we do have a little bit of a food situation. I haven't looked at my food that's in the cellar down there, but I could imagine a lot of it is rotten because all that meat I was just carrying just rotted away, and I'm losing health fast. All right, first thing I want to do really quick is start getting some of these bricks going. We're going to need a lot of them to make glass. Let's see how much this uh let's see how much this will uh give us. And there's going to be uh, a lot of glass around here. First and foremost, I, I actually went and found the uh, the iron because I wanted to make sure we had an iron mine and it was over here. This is where I, this is where I was prospecting. Um, pretty Found it pretty easy. I just dug straight down, took a couple of, uh, a couple of shoots off of the main shaft to find it, but it's a huge, huge, um, huge mine of magnetite I didn't mine any though I, I kind of I just wanted to find it to know oh, it's gonna get blazing hot in here in a second I just wanted to find it to know we had it and when the time comes to mine it we'll go down there and check it out and stuff but that's that's done I kind of just had the free time so I was like let me do something off camera that really doesn't need to be filmed all right, so we got that going so we could get glass going. I also mined quartz. Quartz is everywhere. I uh, see I got I got a stack. I got two stacks here. My inventory is a mess because I moved all the all the chests. All right. Uh, we, uh, let's go check out the food because my, my food is draining super fast. I also have a extra axe and shovel here in the uh, waiting for these two to break because they're gonna break any second. Store this in here for now. What time is it? It it's January second. Oh look at that. It is almost true to uh, the the actual date. And it is 35 degrees out. It's uh, five o'clock. Let's check out our food reserve over here. I, I haven't looked at it in a long time. Um, this is still good. 
All right, so we have we have four males right here, and uh, some peanuts. We got, and we can make all this into bread. All right, not bad, not bad. I thought um I thought it would be much worse. I kind of forgot what we even had in there. I'm gonna put this back in here just for now. Last a little bit longer in there. All right, it's early morning, and next thing I want to do before we get even started on anything else is to get the crops in the ground. It, it is January, but it's 32 degrees here. I, I think that's, that's good enough for a lot of these. Yeah, I mean, everything out here is growing. It's all cold resistant, so it's way below that. Uh, I do take fall damage every time I come out of there. I, I got to fix that. It's so annoying. Anyway, um, I'm just going to throw together a nice little farm right here. It's not going to be anything special. I made a bunch of fences. I got a bunch of stone hoes. So I'm going to just... Make some farmland here. What's going on with this one here? No, because it's forest floor. You can't. Annoying. Okay. Upon further review, I don't think it's a good idea to put crops in the ground right now. Because the moisture level is just garbage. And I forgot to make a watering can. We are in an area where rainfall is common, uh, but this is pretty bad. It's pretty bad. This is just my own design. I don't know what the heck I'm doing here. I I don't want them to die. I mean, I might. I I could probably just drop them in and just go make a watering can real quick before uh before they even. It's really not going to slow down their growth too much because. The, Whatever, man. I'm just going to leave it like that. <laughs> I'm going to make a, a rabbit trap, too. Um, very simple. Just um, like a, just a one square of something growing on it. And then I'm just going to dig out the sides around it. See if that could uh, bring me in some free meat. I kind of like these chickens here that just, uh, they just eat. Some free range chickens. Just hang out right here and eat. That's why I didn't put the farm right here. Alright, so that's that for now. Uh, I totally forgot about the watering can. I definitely have to make a new way up here. A better way. Alright, so my simple solution to this problem is I'm just going to not have this here in the shaft because do we really need we're, we really need both of them run at the same time I don't think so maybe later on I don't know but I, I don't think so right now okay yeah, this whole thing gotta come down So what the, what's going on here now? All right, there we go. Got it working. Uh, and this is a pulverizer. Now, I believe we need a hopper. I don't know. I don't know how this is going to work. Can you put two in? And where does it go? just comes out right here works pretty quick uh, the problem is it needs to be babied we gotta sit here and do this you can build a hopper but a hopper is three 
copper plates and we don't have copper right now although I know where some is I don't really want to go get that right now I think it's yeah it looks like it's only copper I don't know why you can't build it in anything else all right well that is what it is Let's just get a couple of these going here. I get some quartz too. All right, so oh, that didn't work. To make the bricks, you need actually you just need for the lowest level brick, you need the bauxite and the quartz. The olivine is just added for. I think tier two and then you add the ilmenite to tier three and three is like the strongest but we don't have any of that so let's just make a few bricks here just to do it because I've never done it before so we know what we're dealing with uh, I got ten of each now I need clay here See, there's your tier one. There's tier two, and if you put Illuminate right here, it'll be tier three. And this is only giving me ten. I forgot how much you need, but these have to be fired. And I think all my uh, these things are still cooking. Oh no, they're all done. All right, I'm gonna clear these out and let's fire some of these. And I'm I'm gonna make also a watering can. All right, we're gonna throw these in there right now. I made two more, so there's an even twelve. And we got a watering can also. those fired up I'll make more of these I don't plan on making the oven right now anyway there's more parts to it but I'll make more of those bricks um, later on right now I just want to get a lot of basic stuff out of the way all right so we have we have a bunch of these we could start with glass but I this is all I have for charcoal so I do have a decent amount of wood I'm gonna have to make a charcoal pit um, the other thing we need to make is mortar. And it's not complicated. We gotta make slack line, which we I never made before. Sand will give you the mortar. And how do you make the slack line? Water and quick lime. How do you make quick lime? Uh, regular lime. You make regular lime and then you cook it, I guess. I'm going to grind up some of these and see, see how this works. Alright, I made 10 lime here. Now, it just says you cook it. Um, smelting or baking. I don't, does it work on a regular campfire? Okay, it does work. We'll create quick line. That's what we needed, right? Yeah, we need the quick line and we mix that with water and that's going to give us 
slack line. And then we mix that with sand and we got the mortar. All right, so let that cook. Again, I'm not gonna do a whole bunch of them right now. Let's just get the basics. What I need to do is, I need that bucket. I made this here, so this could be an infinite water source. Gonna get it hot enough? That's the next question. Baking temperature 825. It's not. Okay. So we are gonna need a lot of charcoal. So I know what I'm gonna be doing after uh, after this. We should have enough to get this little bit going. That's going to be a while. I don't even know if I'll be able to cook all 10 of them. But we know what we have to do there. Um, it's just it's just a lot of making this stuff. And we have the resources. That's why I brought all this with me. This stuff here. And we got the quartz. Alright. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to sleep. I'm gonna go to sleep and I guess we can start on a fire pit tomorrow. All right. Good news is it cooked all of them. Bad news is they doubled. They uh, yeah, it's doubled. You need two for every one quick climb, but no biggie. We're just uh, we're just testing this out here. And it's just going here. I think um, there's too much water in there. might need another 10. I don't know how I can't cook it though. All right, it says one, oh, that's because it's 10 liters, that's why. Hmm, one liter for four, so this is only one liter. Uh, so, I mean, I have to make 40 of them, which I can't right now because I, I don't even have enough charcoal to cook them up. All right, so we know what the priority is then. We gotta make a charcoal pit. So just give me all this wood. All right, I'm making up a charcoal pit right here. This seems to be what, what, um, what we need, what's holding us back. We need a lot more charcoal. 
Uh, since I'm down here, watering can should be done. If, if it's not done already, it should be done any minute. So let's throw these crops in the ground. And we'll build a little... A, a little, um... A little rabbit trap. Alright, so... There is no really rhyme or reason right now to to crops. I'm just right now I'm just kind of keeping my grains together. Uh, other than that, it's just a farm. Nothing fancy. And that's cassava. We want that was rice. Let's get the flax in there. Pure green. Um, we put the amaranth, amaranth sunflowers. This is all like gonna be bread. It's a lot of bread. So we should get the the soy counts as meat, as a uh, as protein. I think the peanuts do too. We definitely want to get the peanuts in there. Let's get the amaranth in there. Alright, go in there. Peanuts definitely. We're gonna need the soy. We're gonna need it. All right, that's that's good enough. What do I have left over? The cassava and sunflowers. So, I mean, sunflowers is just bread. There's gonna be a whole bunch of bread. Maybe I should, I should just ex expand this a little bit more. Just throw everything in the ground. Alright, there are the crops so far. I did bring my fences down here. Just gonna throw throw these fences around. I didn't, I didn't even make a gate and I forgot to leave grain aside for uh for the rabbits. I think I get I should get it back even at this this low stage. See if I get one of these rice back. Oh, that's flax. Sacrifice the rice because I got the most of it. Yeah, I get it back. I think I only need one. I've actually never made one. Uh, I'm just gonna circle the whole thing right now. I don't even. I don't have a gate. All right, there we go for that. And how about right? I don't want to get the chickens. I might get the chickens to fall in there. It's gonna be a lot of water and how about right here for now we'll do uh I think it should be two two blocks just in case. That's too far. I don't know. Never made one. Didn't really look it up either. Well, if it works, then it's working. If it doesn't work, then I'll bring it into one. One block out. Alright, so that's that. The water can should be done. Let's see if that's done. Alright. It is... 8 o'clock at night, and I'm here watering my crops. So I think that's going to do it for today. Um, there's actually a lot more work ahead of me than I thought. I'm going to need... I'm going to need to make... I might I might make the hopper because there's going to be so much of this, this crushing of the... Uh, 
the quartz and the bauxite that it's going to be worth it to, to go uh, find the copper and just make three plates. It's pretty easy. Other than that, I got to cook up a lot of charcoal. And, and uh, we combine those those bricks that we made with the mortar and that gives us the the bricks to, to make the, uh, the the oven that we're gonna have to use to do the steel uh, yeah to make the steel um, there is a certain amount of iron it is an iron door and then like a basin that you carve out of uh, at a pure andesite which is no problem the other problem with that also is gonna be there needs there needs to be bauxite in that oven too so bauxite I'm gonna get as far as I can without doing bauxite without using it and then when we're there I'm gonna go out and look for the bauxite I think the best place to, to look for it is gonna be in this chert zone over here I believe this is chert because it's in chert um, this is not shale I thought this was shale it's not shale. Is that like a watering map here? Is it, does that mean it's watered? Because over here is not like... Let's check that out. No, I thought I found something, but I guess not. But anyway, um, that is going to be the plan. Man, so some of these crops are already uh, heat stunted, and um, the water, it's like, it's, look, at, look at this. It's 40% already. I just watered it. Anyway, I guess it's true to real life. It's January, and I am south of the equator, so this is the—it's like dead of summer, basically. When I decided to throw these crops in there. Oh man, I'm really gonna have to baby this farm, so oh. I mean, it's gonna keep me busy. But anyway, if I get like half of even all this that I planted, it's gonna be food for a long time. Alright, let's not forget this one over here. Alright. That's going to do it for today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.